I think, I think engineers, uh, I've always said, are natural entrepreneurs. Um, they, they fundamentally have a, have a curiosity as to how things work. They innovate. And uh, throughout, the, throughout the ages, it's engineers that have driven the major inventions uh, for, uh, for society. Uh, so engineers make entrepreneurs. They also understand, understand risks. So, which is very, very important in starting up any business. You have to understand the inherent risks that you're, that you're taking on. And uh, it's not about not taking risks, it's about managing those risks, understanding them at the end of the day, mitigating them. I think the, the thing about being an entrepreneur is actually being in control of your own destiny. It's, uh, you work extremely hard, but you work to your own agenda. And, uh, that, that for me was, was a major, is a major motivation. I guess the, what I'm most proud of is actually having built up companies, a few companies, and seeing them and them, and them being created and all the people working in them that wouldn't otherwise be there. And the fact that you've hopefully had a a positive impact on not just the people who work for the business, but all their all their families and every and everything like that. You created something that wasn't that wasn't there, that is that is hopefully lasting. That it's there for it's there for long for longevity. As you get to a certain size, as you get to a certain profit level, companies start to approach you. If you develop something that is of value within the market then it tends to happen that larger companies want to get access to that and uh, will start to make offers for you. And uh, the, so the, if you're at the stage where you want to be selling the company, you want to be moving on, you have to prepare the company uh, for a sale. You have to get it in a, in a stable state such that it, uh, um, it becomes of, uh, of value to the, any acquiring company. I could stop at this particular point in time. I, could, I have tried to retire several times. Um, but it's the excitement of, of business. I think that's, it's, it's, almost like a, it's almost like a drug. It's certainly not financial motivation. It's the excitement of, of doing things. I think as well what I enjoy now at this particular stage, having gone through it, it's the excitement of giving something back. Um, it's the excitement of, of, of seeing you know, people uh, people develop things, people come up with ideas, and even people within, within our own organization, uh, be developing new things and developing new ideas and giving them the freedom to, uh, to do that. Um, it's just being involved in business and doing things is a very, very exciting and interesting thing to do. The advice that I can give is really as a mentor is uh, covers the whole spectrum of, uh, of starting, growing and selling a, uh, a successful company. Um, I've gone through that process several times from you know, raising venture capital finance to the challenges that there are on, on growing a business and to the final stage of, uh, of ultimately realising the investment and uh, all the work that you've put in, either through a, uh, a sale to a corporate um, or through to an IPO.